And uh, hello and welcome back to the Misfits Podcast, rated five stars on YouTube by Jacob. He says, I hope that Mason will update us on the progress of his portal. Oh, and here we have Mason to update. Oh. Oh, oh, he's actually working on his portal right now. He's oh. on here. As we speak. As we speak, he's cracking away. What if he's away. gone through it? Going Holy through shit. it? Like emotionally? Yeah, that's what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> what if he's going through it right now? What if he's struggling with the portal? I don't okay. know. No, Mason's hard at work. He's got a wrench yeah. in his hand. He's cranking away. He's got grease all over him. Yeah, lard. Mm, covered in grease. Covered in grease. Getting, covered in game of lard. Just going, putting the finishing touches on it. He's yeah. got the GPU processing graphics card unit. Yeah. The montage and the music in the background is going as we speak. That's right. Ba- na- 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 na. Is that the do, do, do. That's the portal <laughs> song? <laughs> That's what he listens to? Do, do, do. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Toby's here. Hi. I'm here. Yeah, no portal for you. No portal for me. Just, I'll be just, staying right here. Thank yeah, you. No need for alternate dimensions for Toby. No. She's happy enough with this one. Ah, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She'll be yeah, right. It's all right. What's wrong with this dimension? Ah, <laughs> uh, there's issues. And issues. <laughs> you know what? That, you know that there's there's actually ice top and bottom of Earth, right? Yeah. Yeah. I heard that it's melting. Melting. Yeah. Oh, really? Well, the ice is going away. And also, they call it an ice cap. Yeah. They say the ice caps. Mm. But a mm. cap can only go on the top of your head, not the bottom of your head. Or in right. your mouth. So it's just one ice cap. <laughs> doesn't make much sense. So why it? is it ice caps? Well, how are all these countries staying on the bottom of this fucking earth thing anyway? <laughs> <laughs> Swear goes here, he can explain it. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to have to repeat <laughs> I'm saying, question. dude, if the earth is fucking round, right. then how come the countries on the bottom aren't falling off? Because it's not fucking it's round. Glue, bro. It's flat. Yeah, I know. Glue. A globe? Glue. Glue? Glue. They glued it there? Yeah. Who did that? Chris Columbus? No, the Mayans. I heard he was racist. The Aztecs. <laughs> the Aztecs? Yes. What do they know? Oh, uh, well, I mean, well, fair enough. They, they predicted the world would end in 2012, but well, sadly, idiots. here Wrong. we are. Idiots. Mm. I thought that was yeah. the Mayans. That was the Mayans. Oh, maybe it was the Mayans. Yeah, and they were nine yeah. years and off. You should mind your own business about that, because actually, they might have been right, and we misinterpreted the history. Jay's here. Yeah, well, yeah. I'm here also. <laughs> He's going to comment on the fact. <laughs> yeah, the Mayans were actually nine years off. 2021 is the year that uh, the world's going to end. Yeah. 2021. Yeah. Yep. That's, this, that's, that's this year that we're, we're in right now. Uh, currently in 2021. Yeah, yeah the yeah. Yellowstone Caldera is bound to erupt in a couple of months. Yeah, that's when Mayan Minecraft comes out. Yes. <laughs> Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> what does that game look like? It's just a bunch of Mayans, isn't it? What do Mayans look like? Uh, exactly. You don't fucking know because you didn't do your history homework. I haven't played the game. Well, when I give you history homework, I expect you to complete it. Yeah. Well, it's in well, close sir. Matt's here. He always does his history homework. <laughs> yeah, bro. I swear I've been living in the Matrix since 2012. The nothing Matrix? Is, nothing's felt real since then. Nothing's Tell felt. Tell me I'm wrong. You're, yeah. it, you've been in the Matrix since 2012. Yeah, all of us have. What? Well, and in 2012, we've just been living in the Matrix. I don't know. I can't slow down time and avoid bullets. That. The Matrix is awful. Yeah. Why did we go in there? Because hmm. the world ended. Nobody's the world wearing ended. a long That's how they coat. keep it going. You know? Oh, because the mines were accurate. Yeah, yeah. So in, in order to prevent it, we went in the Matrix. Yeah, we didn't even realize Fuck. It. This makes a lot of sense. This makes so much sense. <laughs> yeah. And we're right for yeah. you guys. Fitz is here too, guys. <laughs> oh, I'm here too. Hello. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> it's another week on the Misfits podcast. We're all yes. here that it on is. the new set. Look at this nice view we have out oh, the window. Oh, so, it's so good. It's so Crazy. peaceful. Yeah. So Why we've actually got a mobile set. So every every yeah. week where we've got a nice new background that yeah. uh, is just showing off what's happening outside. We're in an RV. Why do we choose uh, a swamp? Uh, it's, it's, not, it's not a swamp. It's not it's a, a swamp. swamp. A pond. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's a bayou. A pond. It's a bayou. A pond because we're here to ponder things. Mm. Mm. That's right, Jim. Oh, that's wow. good. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. This might po- actually be a ma- matrix. This might be a matrix. It might be a matrix we're in. What have you been pondering lately, Jay? I've been pondering why uh, the Mayans were wrong about 2012? 2012. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they were a bit off, weren't they? A little bit, a little slightly bit off. off. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, not everyone's right about everything. I suppose mm. this podcast is evidence. Everybody of that. makes mistakes. Yeah. That's yeah. right. Yes. I had I had someone uh, email me recently telling me that something that Swagger had said on the podcast was actually inaccurate. Oh yeah. Really? Like, we never, yeah, it never really happened. Happened. That one thing is inaccurate. It. We we have very uh, very many inaccurate things on the podcast. <laughs> what, what was what, <laughs> was, what did I get wrong? I don't remember. I didn't read the email. Yeah. yeah. Well, fair enough. I don't know how to Probably read. Probably a fucking liar. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck that guy. <laughs> fucking liar. Yeah, I mean, it's literally just you first of them. Yeah, you know? everything like, I say mm. is, is completely accurate. Everything we all say is completely accurate. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's why we have a podcast. COVID isn't real. Bill Gates puts microchips in your nose. Don't forget 5G. Yeah. Wait, 5G I've... radiation gives you HIV, cancer, Wait, but I haven't COVID. got HIV. You haven't got it? No. That's why? Surprising. Did you guys get it? Yeah, I got the yeah. new one. Yeah. You got it with yeah. your phone plan? It's the update. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I got HIV X. 
in oh, Heavy X. With the Apple Pro Max. I missed mm. out. Mm. <laughs> oh, so you're on Android. That's why. Yeah. Speaking of COVID, system. I got a COVID test. Oh, yeah. Oh. How would you go with that? I had one too. Yeah, not bad. It, it it's was, a bit it's weird. It's not fun, is it? It's, it's like uncomfortable, but it's not too bad. They kind of just jab it back. back Shove your it nose. in your nose, do a little mick twist. And then they have to do it on the other yeah. one as well. Yeah, and did it, did it do it in your mouth in the as mouth. well? Yeah, yeah what I didn't understand, like they do the the back of the mouth into the nostril into the other nostril. Seems like a lot of mixing of bacteria there. <laughs> yeah, why don't they use mm. three swabs? Well, because it's just your body. Yeah, but surely that's mixing in three different things. Yeah, yeah but you know, have you ever like eaten your boogers as a child? No, I don't mean for me or as an adult I mean for them right? or as an adult. <clears throat> Eating boogers as an adult? It's actually not that common, Jay. Not that common? Wait, no, no really? surely you're not. Matt's got a it's mask not. on. <laughs> no. well, the, well, what's that logo on? Is that Spotify? Is it? Is oh, that, is that right the platform down, where, this, oh. where this podcast is a week early on? Yeah. You know, I heard that you made a playlist I, recently. I did make a playlist ah. for Spotify. Oh, oh, oh my God. God. What? Look at that. It's the start to make playlist on Spotify with a bunch of tunes that I selected to represent, I, I, I guess, uh, a wide variety of tastes. If you want to go check that out. Follow the start to like playlist on Spotify. There's some bangers on there. Maybe you'll like a couple of the tunes. Like Give it a I know songs. I do. Got like at least one of those. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, I like, like the one. songs. Yeah, you like songs. Yeah. What's your favorite kind of song? What, what kind of songs do you like where they're singing about? You know, like, uh, what are the topics? I like, like when music? they sing about the domestic violence. Yeah. <laughs> that was my favorite. So you like you like a lot of rap. You know that song that's like. Do you feel like a man when you push her around? Yeah. That song. So you, that's the only yeah, song that's, I listen that's to. That's like a song like advocating against domestic violence mm. yeah i didn't say i was for it I just right it kind of makes you seem like you're for it but no uh, <laughs> i was like i do feel like a man when i push her around <laughs> i do i love this song <laughs> like so red well. jumpsuit apparatus <laughs> do you feel better now when she falls to the ground I, yep. well actually yeah, <laughs> significantly so <laughs> <laughs> shit speaking of domestic violence Swagger and I did a charity stream yes. uh, for uh, that was uh, supporting kids in, in unfortunate situations. Yes, yeah, the Australian wow. Childhood Foundation. Yeah, yeah, yeah it was a uh, charity stream uh, with Crocker, the game Crocker. Oh, very cool game. Yeah, very, very good game. Where does um, it go? $33,000 $33, in 24 hours? In 24 Damn. hours. Yes. All that money is going towards putting kids in uncomfortable situations. Yes. Yeah. No, <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> uh, it's, uh, it's, it's to give them a place for, like... Uh, uh, w w what's the word? Uh, rehabilitation and healing. That's cool. Damn. Yeah. So people that you know, like kids that are, yeah, mm -hmm. grow up in really really bad homes, a wow. lot of abuse and stuff like that. That's lovely. It's amazing. Yeah. You should feel very good about that. Yeah. 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 I do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking good. Actually, I'm a great person. <laughs> And everyone loves me. Yeah, yeah. No, it was, <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was it was fucking sick. It was it was really really good thing to do. The twenty four hours of Krunker? No, no. It was uh, a bunch of different creators uh, in time oh, slots. It was it was put together by Hey I'm Zed, which mm. is uh, we, we actually did another mm. uh, tournament with him. Cool cap. Like way way long ago. I think we actually have the. Yeah, here it is. Oh yeah, it's a trophy oh, that we shit. won. Yeah. Why is Hold it, on, when is? Why is it a truck? Uh, yeah, we won. Yeah, it was the game. The game Holy was called shit. Moving Out. Oh. Uh, Champions, so this is, uh, you know, we ended up getting that with him. Yeah. So yeah. if anyone ever says that we're losers, we clearly won that. Yeah. yeah idiots. Jeez. Fuck you. Suck on those nuts, audience. Yeah. On you guys. Yeah. That's God. amazing. I wish I could just talk to the audience. <laughs> Oh, you want, oh you've got suck on the nuts. that's giving me a nice pair of nuts. Nice pair of fucking that's a, balls. That's a real nice pair. Yeah, always useful to have a spare. <laughs> <laughs> put, put those down. Those there. are like hard nuts. You know, they're pretty solid. All mm. the thick nuts. Well, you want you want fortified nuts. Mm. Yeah. Mm. yeah, makes you feel safer around you know fourteen year olds that want to sack tap you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what fourteen year olds do. Why do you just make it sound like fourteen year olds are just hyenas roaming the? <laughs> roaming the Have streets. you ever seen a fourteen year old? <laughs> They're fucking vicious. Yeah. yeah, they're obsessed with two things: drawing cocks and <laughs> slapping each other's balls. Yeah, I don't know how yeah. many cocks I slapped back in my day. Yeah, they're uncountable. The thousands, yeah, they're really just analyzing like, what the hell are these things? These yeah, and they analyze it by smacking it with the back of their hand. Yeah. Right. Now, why do you think it is that young men specifically put dry dicks on everything? Why do you think the dick is the most like mm. universal piece of graffiti? Out there. I mean, it, it is kind of funny, though. Yeah, it's funny. Yeah, it's funny, it's but funny. why draw the dick? What it's, makes that funny? The penis is the most masculine, masculine thing in the world. It's also easy to draw. 
It yeah. is very yeah. easy That's to true. Easy to yeah. draw. Yeah. You can do it with like one stroke. It's not like tits where you gotta like lift it up. I don't know. Times. You, I usually take a few yeah, more than one stroke. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Dicks are just. I mean, they are fourteen. Funny. You gotta give them credit. <laughs> yeah, they're fourteen or or sometimes younger. They're mm. just they're just thinking about oh, there's a new purpose for this dick that I didn't realize beyond mm. peeing, and they're mm. fascinated, and so they draw a bunch of dicks. Are also just funny in general. And when you get older, dicks become more like. You're not allowed to talk about your dicks. You're not allowed to show your dicks and stuff right. as you get older and older. Yes. Yeah, there he goes. Yeah, yeah yes. Drawings um, and there's one is a banana. Is that George this Washington? Is a, this is a clip from Superbad, no? Yeah, yeah it is. Yeah. yeah. Which is... Uh, I mean, I feel like it's just people being uh, wanting to draw something that they know they're not meant to draw, they're not meant yeah, to show. I think yes. it's, it's probably just because it's the easiest thing to draw that's also the most offensive. It, like, I don't an know, adult, you could write the word cunt. <laughs> you could write you the could word cunt. You could draw a vagina. But that's much that's more way difficult. Lot harder, yeah. harder. It's a little out of the artistic. No one knows what a vagina looks like. Yeah, especially yeah. that young, you don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. It's yeah, like, they probably just don't know. Yeah. Well, I guess they do now because of porn and all that. I have a world record for the fastest uh, cock drawn as a fourteen-year-old. Really? Really? Yeah, it was zero point three six seconds. That's a fucking quick dick. Yeah, it was a Guinness World Record. I had no. someone like officially come in. When we say <laughs> yeah. when we say drawn, we don't mean drawing it out. We mean like oh, actually, yeah. actually yeah. drawing. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I've got. I mean, I still have a world record then. It's yeah, just, that's still good. A, yeah. Right. Just whip draw. It, you draw your dick out and then you <laughs> just outline it like a stencil. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. that's smart. Yeah, that's uh, there's True. a reason why it was 0.36 See, seconds. See, the thing is, though, if you actually outlined your dick like a stencil, people probably wouldn't even recognize it as a dick. Yeah. Mm. They'd be they like, just... this is a very malformed thumb. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Because the dicks that people draw don't actually look like dicks, really. Yeah. No, no. Very rarely. Unless you're the guy from Superbad and a very talented work with your f- phallus, phallus drawings. drawings. Mm. Mm. It really mm. speaks to artistic sophistication. Yeah. You have an accurate rendition of a dick, I think. Quite beautiful. Mm. Because, beautiful. That's why you know, Picasso started. People couldn't, yeah. you, you know, they couldn't make accurate dicks in the past. That's why all statues have yeah. leaves over their cocks mm. or, uh, or, or just really small penises. You know, if uh, Hitler drew dicks, he probably would have been able to get into art school and yeah. could have avoided uh, the genocide. Yeah. yeah, but he kept fucking up with the hair on it. He had like this little, like mini little stash. Yeah. On it. Yeah. He did, really have, he did have like it was the, a, it's called a landing strip. Ah. Yeah. A weird obsession with it. It was a landing square. <laughs> oh, really. okay. Yeah. Hitler's just got a little Hitler stash on top of his dick. That's funny. I like, I like to think he did that. I like to think he did that. I like to think that whenever he got erect, he'd go, hi. <laughs> 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 excellent. That's funny. Uh, excellent. Yeah. That is just I, awful. Dick rise for Germany, you know? Oh, <laughs> my God. Time for Germany. Fantastic times. Absolutely fantastic. Guys, yeah. I don't know how long, how much longer I'm going to be able to do the podcast for because I got an email the other day saying that I'd won $10 million. $10 what? Million. what? Yeah, an Arabian prince. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Wait, an Arabian? Yeah, an Arabian prince ten, is going to wire me $10 million. All I have to do is give him my bank account details. What? I haven't done it yet. I thought I'd break the news what? to you guys. That's just fucking, yeah. dude. That's Congrats. Good. That's, Thanks. That's, yeah, I just figured I'd, I, I, figured I, I'd say that. I don't mean to be a negative Nancy, but yeah. <laughs> like, do you, do you think that like, that he means it? Well, I think he did. It was like a... Right. Yeah. Was that, what was, how was it worded? He just said like, yo. like He said yo. Yeah, he started off with yo and you've, with yo. you've won $10 million. 10 mil. And like, what, what are you just going to say no? Yeah, like, but like, what did, why did, did you give him your email? Did you sign up for something? No, no, it was that was the weird part. Like, it, he just must have well, found Well, Jay's email's all over the internet. Yeah, his business email, right. you know? Yeah. It's public it's information. Business. But yeah, no, it just popped up in my email, like a SP spam folder. Spam mm. folder. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's... Um, that's where you get like a lot of emails coming in. There's too many to count. So Super yeah. positive. Luckily, I checked it. <laughs> Affirmative <laughs> mail. So yeah. I was just reading my spam folder as yeah. like I do. <laughs> luckily, <laughs> luckily, I checked it, man, because <laughs> damn, ten million dollars richer. What other kind of shit do you get in your spam folder? Ah, uh, stuff like signing up to porn, yeah. like gay, yeah, like porn. gay stuff. Okay. Yeah. yeah, okay, like Viagra. Yeah, that's ads and yeah, shit, <laughs> yeah, that's like that. spam. It's spam. That's not me. Yeah. I don't do that. Yeah, but it's like based on your browsing history. But whatever. Like, yeah. You know. that's just <laughs> <laughs> Well, I mean, like, congrats, I guess. Thank you, what are you going to do yeah. with all that money? I, I, I don't know yet. I'm just going to invest it in Bitcoin and stuff. <laughs> oh, all of it in Bitcoin? <laughs> all of it. No, every single, you every all single of it last. Doge, dude. Don't all just go into the do- moon. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Mm. It's going right to the moon. I wonder how many, like, old people actually fall for that sort of stuff. What, like, Dogecoin? Uh, want, no, well, that as A well. A ton but, of them. Like, Elon's one of them. <laughs> the <laughs> scam emails and stuff. I wonder how many, like, if there's a statistic of some sort. Oh, yeah. There, like, there's this channel. people actually do. There's this channel on YouTube with this dude that, like, pretends to be an old person and, like, scammers from India will uh, will call him and he'll like he'll like he's like running on a virtual machine and he'll like hack through like their 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 
Yeah, yeah, this dude, Kit Bogan. Oh, this um, dude, yeah, I've seen him before. Uh, th- th- there's other channels that also do it for, like, hours, like, full-on calls where yeah. they'll, like, they, they do this thing called, I, I think it's called, like, Team Player or, or, or something like that. Team Viewer? Team Viewer. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And they'll, like, get remote access to people's accounts yeah. and, and all that. So then it, it sets up a two-way connection. So this guy will just go into this, you know, random hacker, you know, scammer's fucking email or whatever, just delete all of his files on his computer, like, delete everything and then get his reaction and be like, you know, you fucking scam old people. Yeah. (laughs) You know, like, you're a fucking asshole. The hackers get so mad. Which, you know, I can understand because all of the hackers are just trying to make a buck. All the scammers, yeah. I wonder how much they make, though. Well, they they clearly make enough to keep doing it. Yeah, Yeah. you're right. A lot of them are, like, in firms. So, like, what's interesting about that Kit Bogey guy, I believe it was him, he's actually, like, hacked into the security cameras at the, yeah. like, scam Shit. firms that's where they work. There's, like, a whole that's office insane. for them doing that Yeah, shit? like, oh, you cool. look through the camera and spy on them. Like, they're at their desks. There's just, like, little organizations that just hire a bunch of people. Most of the, most of the scammers... Oh, the, this, this dude, yeah. yeah. Browning. It was Jim a viral Browning. video, I think. A viral video that popped yeah. up. A viral like, video? Yeah, it was, like, 30 million views. Wait, what's a viral video? What what actually constitutes a viral <laughs> video these days? It feels like everything's viral now. You know? I mean, well, yeah, everything's was, viral was now. Interesting. Fucking COVID. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Other Every, things probably. Look, look at that. Yeah. Oh, look, you can just see. That's where they worked. It's CCTV footage. It's just our building. <laughs> it's just <laughs> the Misfits <laughs> office. That's all we do. We just scam old people. God, they're so easy to scam. Yeah. Ah, it's insane. You take the money, give them one push down the steps, and no one asks any questions. Yeah, because yeah. people fall down stairs all the time. That's true. Mm. I Idiots. fall down stairs all the time. Yeah. 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 Broke my hip. Broke your hip. Yeah. Getting uh, old. You got 10 million in the bank, but no hip. No hip. I can get a hip replacement, though. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Well, I guess yeah. you can. Speaking of viral videos, though, there's these things that came out recently on YouTube. Shorts? Yeah, have you, seen have you guys I think heard about Schwar- them? Schwartz have been around for a while. Yeah, they're like they fight, they're like fucking TikToks. <laughs> yeah, pretty much like oh, TikToks. Yeah, and yeah, I've been yeah. seeing like um, tons of creators just making super clickbaity shorts. Mm-hmm. And I wanted to do like an experiment on the podcast where we just say some random shit and just clip it. So yeah. like, yeah, I, I think um, an example was Harry from the Sidemen. Have you, do you guys know who he is? I know, I know Harry. Yeah. Yeah, he just makes tons of clips from his live stream. Like, Dada, how much money does Dada Dada make? And they just go nuclear on YouTube. Real? Yeah, mm, it's just crazy. like ten second clips. Yeah, that that short form content is just blowing yeah. up. It's so popular now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, like oh, that. big guy, so, big like, But these aren't these aren't like YouTube yeah, aren't shorts. Cl- yeah, these, these are like actual shorts. videos, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah because but, like it's almost like YouTube's copying TikTok and like yeah, yeah exactly. They want you to just consume they more. They did it more when content. TikTok was going to get banned in in America, right? I think it was something. It was something like that. I think. But yeah, I thought it'd be funny if we just start saying like random super clickbaity things on the podcast. <laughs> just, just click them. Yeah, that sounds... See how many views we can get. <laughs> yeah. Well, we need some good clickbait. Yeah. We need, we... To, we need to think up a storm here. We need to think of something like the okay. perfect thing to say, the perfect combination of perfect words combination. that'll get us 10 million views on a show. 10 million views. Okay. So we got money. <clears throat> Why Hitler about? was good. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right. It's like the pros and cons list. <laughs> All right, pros. Great Go artist. Those bubbles. Good artist. <laughs> Fashionable. Yeah. yeah. Great leadership skills. True. Yeah. Uh, charismatic. Yeah. Charismatic. Yeah. Tra- Tra- trendsetter. Trendsetter. Mm. Arguably mm. handsome for his time. Yeah. Great yeah. voice. Great voice. Probably. Great. Great yellow. <laughs> so we're all yeah. good yeller. Yeah. Good. Nice. Nice salute. Yeah. Good posture. Always shared his yeah. mouth around with yeah. the boys. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Always, um, I was always happy to share the pipe. All Hitler was. Yeah, fucked his cousin. Fucked his cousin. Mm. All right, uh, let's do the cons. Uh, well, yeah, what, con- what, 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 was there another? Well, pro? this could be a pro or a con. Okay. He, he ate one chocolate bar a day. One chocolate bar a day. Wait, he one did. One chocolate bar a day. Yeah. Dark, dark cocoa or what? I have no idea. Did he eat apple to ask day him. too? Or? Yeah, just that. chocolate. No, how's he keeping them dogs this way? Anyway, it's, it's a lot of views right now. We've just obtained a lot of views. <laughs> um, <laughs> farming them in. Yeah, we're well, farming. we're only we're only on the fucking pros, mate. We haven't even done the cons. Yeah, the yet. cons. So now, why Hitler was bad? Oh, All right. hang on. Well, I'm personally stumped. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't know. I like, <laughs> I personally, Jeez. wait, he did that Holocaust thing though. Oh, well, that, that, was, that wasn't like him. That was, that shit, was like though. other people. I guess yeah. that's true. How many yeah. how many Jews did Hitler really kill? Personally, yeah, probably uh, some, very yeah. few, probably yeah. at least some. Yeah, but I think like they probably were like bothering him. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I mean he was just a real estate mogul. He had those camps. Yeah, like I just don't, I don't, I'm, I don't, I hate being a victim blamer. But you know, you gotta. Well, I was like, like, what were these Jews doing at the time? You know, to for him to do this. You know, yeah. what were they saying? <laughs> I'm sorry. It's terrible. <laughs> some of the more views. <laughs> I can just see them rolling in. <laughs> yeah, listen. 
Hitler was pretty bad. He was pretty. He, he was, was pretty, pretty bad, dude. Pretty we could sit here all day and brainstorm the ways in which he was a great leader and, and person, but really, when you get down to it, kind of a he sh- did kind some of a shit shady things. character. Yeah. You know, and history likes to gloss over for that. <laughs> yeah. History but have you ever seen the picture the of like of Hitler with his shirt off? Oh God, Mitchell, Mitchell, mind. pull up, pull up the the picture of Hitler with his shirt on. <clears throat> I'm excited to see this. Uh, yeah. Never. Oh, oh my God! Oh my God! He's yeah. just like Stalin. Yeah. That's what I mean when I'm right there. Really <laughs> handsome first time. <laughs> okay, dude, look, look, he's, he had great taste in music. The Nickelback one. <laughs> Where was it? Go, go back, go back. <laughs> there, there, right oh, there. Right there on the left. Yeah, dude, look. <laughs> Holy shit! That guy's got taste. Another pro. Yeah, another like pro. Other. Good taste look at in, dr- look at in, in music. The, the left. Look at the that one. shorts are nice. Look at, yeah. yeah, look at the shorts. No, that's not too bad. Hitler had great shoulders. Dude, he's jacked. I know oh, he's jacked. Is, is that, this real? Is yeah, that, is that, real. Is that Putin there on the left as well? Putin, yeah, he's Putin there. P- Putin's hilarious because Putin will like, t- like unironically take photos of him just like shirtless on a horse for propaganda. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> to, yeah, to, to seem like a strong Russian man. Yeah. Fuck, it's so strange. Putin's a dodgy cunt. I will say. Yeah. Oh, he's a oh look at him with yeah. that. The Mustache? What the fuck? Oh. What the fuck? He's, not the that's, same. that's not no. the same guy. No, the same if guy Hitler no. didn't have his mustache, no one would even remember that <laughs> shit. It's like it's like uh, Superman, Clark Kent, <laughs> yeah, yeah. when he takes his glasses off, he's Superman. <laughs> mm. Why is it Taika right. Waititi? Okay. 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 Right. Mitchell, Mitchell, so Mitchell get, get this shit off. Through Mitchell <laughs> Hitler, <laughs> <laughs> just just starts like clicking through Wikipedia articles about <laughs> Holocaust or some yeah, horrific just, footage. Yeah, but the final pro, sexy. Yeah. With his shirt on. Final pros. Hitler will do be kind of sexy. Like, yeah. That was okay. impressive, though, you know? <coughs> yeah. I mean, someone in his position could get away with being pretty lazy, but he, he clearly went to the gym. Yeah. Like, he mm. walked the walk and talked the talk. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. God. Got got him. Him. And he got also him. fucked his cousin and killed himself. Well, did he kill himself? Yeah, he, he ate the cyanide, but I, an officer shot him in the back of the head with the, with the, mm. with the Luger. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but if I shoot a dead person in the back of the head, that doesn't mean I killed them. Well, not in the process of dying. I don't think the cyanide fully hit, which oh, kind of was kind of that's a shame. Kind of so the cyanide. so the officer kind of almost like stole his kill. Yeah, yeah, kind kill of a dog move. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Yikes. Yikes. That'd be a big bounty, I feel like. History is just full of all sorts of dodgy facts. Yeah. Mm. I wonder what's what another the, one? What's the dodgiest <laughs> shit in 100 years I'll look back on in 2021 and be like, that was a little bit dodgy. 100 years. Uh, so that's COVID, when we find out uh, it was all fake. When it was yeah. mm. all fake or mm. when it was all intentional. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, that too. Yeah. Oh, that, but that sounds real. I was, I was making a joke. Oh. So. We, we don't tell jokes here. Oh. I mean, the bird flu sounds kind of sketchy because it's like, how do, like, the birds get the flu? Like. <laughs> I've never seen a bird like, sneeze. Well, yeah. seen a bird at doctors. <laughs> exactly. I don't know. Like, don't know if that's real. Like, swine flu sounds made Fuck up. Fucking someone ask give me. these birds a lozenge. Exactly. <laughs> Have any of you ever up. seen a baby pigeon? Uh, no. no. I can't say Oh that. my God, you're right. Have, Have you, you ever seen a fuck? I've never seen a baby pigeon. Yeah. Have you ever seen an Asian man with a beard? Yeah. <laughs> Many times. Yeah. <laughs> okay, cool. I was just wondering. Okay, cool. Just wondering. All right. Well, now that we've got that fact confirmed that yeah. Asian men can in fact grow beards, and that pigeons don't have babies because they're robots. Mm. Robots they're made by the government. Are fake. Bro, Whoa. that's a baby Whoa. pigeon. Oh, oh, no wonder we don't see them. They're embarrassed. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> baby pigeons look kind of gross, man. Yeah, I'm oh, glad no. I haven't seen well, one. Most baby birds look kind of gross. They kind of come out like fetuses. What about a baby duck? Mm. They're real cute. Mm. Oh, oh, he's, he's kind of it's kind of endearing though. He kind of starts up. <laughs> I Dude. love that. Oh, that's great. Damn. Oh I love God. when babies think they're tough. Yeah. <laughs> Just go up to a baby. Yeah. You think you're so fucking tough, don't you? <laughs> and it spits in your <laughs> face. Gaga. Fuck you, <laughs> bro. When you think about it, they are kind of like invulnerable. You punch them in the head and the soft spot will just absorb your hand. I don't know if that's, that's how that works. Yeah, it's actually I tried the opposite it. of invulnerable. It's, it's not here like tough your kids it. up, right? Yeah. You just, yeah. yeah. You, you shake them around. Beat the yeah. shit out of them. You, you just shake them. You, you, you grab their ankle and you just kind of flail them around. <laughs> we used to have ads on TV in New Zealand. Never like, shake a baby. Never yes. shake a baby. Yeah. Did you guys have those in America? No. No, it was, it was stuff like... Well, lots and lots of trains, and there'd be like a little train commercial about about right. like the epic the epic cool train book that you can oh. get. Do you guys remember <laughs> the ad? Uh... <laughs> yeah, it was the same. It was American right. commercial. What's, what's the deal about not shaking yeah. a baby? Was this? Oh, it's just oh. don't shake a baby. Yeah, because like New, okay. New, New Zealand has, has a lot of commercials that are like don't cut it out. Yeah, fucking knock it off. It's New Zealand. Be like, come on, guys. Come on, guys. Yeah. Drug like, driving, not okay. Like there's Drug one driving, not okay. Shaking babies, not on. Was Domestic there, abuse was, towards women. One was there a baby shaking problem? I, I, I mean, think it's just advice. General I think it's, advice. It's just a reminder, <laughs> yeah. like, hey, mate, 
don't shake your fucking baby. Yeah. You don't want to shake the baby. You know. Yeah. There was one where uh, the, this kid runs up to his to his dad. He's like, "Airplane, daddy, airplane." Guy goes, he's a bit drunk, doesn't want to do airplane, but his son's like, please, airplane. He <laughs> grabs him by the arms and legs and swings him around in circles like he's an airplane, smacks his head into a wardrobe, doesn't he? Oh. Mm. Kid dies. Then he gets his other one, throws him into the fucking Pentagon. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Then, <laughs> I don't remember that ad. <laughs> and then it says, and then it says, never airplane a baby. Airplane <laughs> a baby. No, I don't uh, actually know. What I think it was don't drink and airplane your babies. It's <laughs> <laughs> just so every single thing you can imagine. <laughs> Some really specific <laughs> <laughs> cautionary commercials from New Zealand. That's <laughs> why so our crime rate so low. Don't push your baby's <laughs> hand on the stove. <laughs> <laughs> the airplane ad is a real thing. I swear. I just don't know what it was. What it was trying to stop. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, don't throw your baby in a pit of boiling water. Come on. Please, don't try and boil your baby. <laughs> don't boil a baby. <laughs> don't play with your babies when you're drunk. <laughs> Fuck. Apparently, yeah. Yeah, but no New Zealand legit had many commercials like that. We had anti-drug commercials. We had a lot of anti-drug oh, we don't have commercials. Those. No. No, we love They're drugs. like, oh, you want some weed? Good on you. <laughs> <Yeah>. Call 1-800-WEED. <laughs> Yeah, what what were your uh, anti drug commercials like? What was the tone? Uh, scaring the shit out of anybody that watched it. Like this shit. is your like the, <laughs> the fucking woman. Brain. This is your brain. <laughs> she like has a flaming hot skillet, and then she's like cracks an egg on it, and then it starts fucking bubbling. She's like, "This is your brain on drugs." How and then she starts smashing shit. She starts like smack. There was like another commercial like ten years after like the original one, which was like, "This is your brain. This is your brain on drugs." And then the egg and the whatever. But then there's one where she's like, "This is your brain on drugs." And she starts ha having like a mental breakdown. She starts fucking breaking everything with the pan. Jeez. Well, maybe she was on drugs. There was one with the fucking lizard guy. I think I've talked about this Mark before Zuckerberg. on the podcast. Uh, Geico. No, no, no. <laughs> No, no, it's like Geico says no to drugs. It's like uh, it's like this why it's like this young like this young like thirteen year old white kid or whatever, and he's yeah. just like you know skater kid like nineties fucking get up and everything. He's walking down the street, and there's this one guy that pops in. And he's like, "Yo, kid, you want to do some drugs? I got some drugs." And then he's like, "Oh yeah, I have some drugs." And then like as he's like explaining like how the drugs will make him feel or whatever, like he starts turning. This guy starts morphing into like a lizard person and then like he's like don't you think drugs are cool and then, and then, then it like drugs ends. more i know like yeah. that's the kind of shit i see on drugs dude that'd be yeah. fucking hectic and and lizard people people you like literally drugs. saw an orgonian from fucking like skyrim bro Crazy. Fucking, I, I dig and now we learn that actually the people you know in charge of these commercials are the lizards you know yeah. it's mm -hmm. not actually the the drug dealers <sighs> It's the people in the government. The, the drug dealers are actually good people. That's right. Yeah. The lizards. Governments are bad. Overthrow the government. Drugs Governments are good. Smoke terrible. weed. Imagine if there was just no government whatsoever anywhere. Anarchy? Anarchy. It'd be not, horrible. Not necessarily mm. complete chaos. Maybe yeah. there was just some system in place where there was just no one in charge. Well, complete chaos <laughs> is impossible. And yeah. nobody in charge is also impossible. As soon as you uh, just... You create a power vacuum and, and there's nobody in charge, then everybody starts to take charge. Mm. And like society organizes and arranges itself like completely naturally. Yeah. There are people that are, you know, it's, alphas it's, it's and then people, you know, yeah. there, there's, there's, there's leaders and then there's followers. Yeah. yeah. And if you're not a leader, you're a fucking pussy. You're a sheep. Yeah, you're a loser. Of apostles Wake up, sheeple. If you ask me. <laughs> yeah. So that tribalism, I guess, people just form, form yeah. that way. Yeah. 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 Or they get dominated into being a, Submission. a follower. Yeah. That's me. <laughs> Hi. Hello, <laughs> Hello <laughs> kitten. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, New Zealand had uh, different anti-drug commercials. Yeah. Were, I don't want your ghost chips. They were never yes. like, don't do drugs. They were like, all right, so you've done some drugs. Just don't drive home. Yeah. Like, yeah. Know, yeah. That's great. kind of good. That's yeah. you know, actually harm excellent. reduction. The, the, yeah. the commercials won many. I think we've talked about this before, but they've, they've won like awards and shit because of their... Uh, creativity mm. and execution yep. they're very like yeah we, endearing they execute, execute people, people on <clears throat> execute them on the street yeah and do drugs and yeah I, I feel like that's kind of the attitude in, in new zealand it's like well if you've done drugs yeah that's all right just don't don't you know put anyone else in danger mm. no, no yeah. airplane no baby airplanes no yeah. baby, no no baby, baby airplanes. airplanes no none of that <laughs> no boiling babies nothing no boiling babies like, mate you've done a bit of cheeky caps night good on you probably feel great just don't stick your kid in the pot of water yeah. <laughs> which everyone loves doing an mdma oh my name yeah, oh, i just want to stick my oh, kid in a fucking vat of acid yeah <laughs> 
just want to dunk my newborn in this. I just want a baby bro. Kind of instant noodle. I feel so much love. I just want to kill my child. <laughs> Maybe if I drink the water it was boiled in, it'll give me powers. It'll it'll make me nutrients. young again. I've just noticed there's a webcam there. What the fuck is that? Who's watching us? That's the, one of the scammers. Uh, oh, I oh, knew it. Shit. Just checking in. It's actually the, is that the guy that gave Jay money? The Arabian, <laughs> oh, uh, the Arabian prince isn't a scammer. Yeah, that's no, real. Just, but he does keep tabs on you, doesn't he? Yeah. Like he, he, made, he, made you, he made you send... The, he he made like you, sent my address and stuff. Yeah. I was like, how do you know that? Then he like asked me to like photos. Yeah, I sent like, them, obviously. <laughs> but like, they were kind of like a little weird, weren't they? Yeah, yeah. He, he asked you to tape rubbish bags to your body <laughs> and then inflate them with a air compressor. <laughs> yeah, like, it, was, it was really weird. It was really <laughs> weird. to visualize that. What was that even mean? Uh, oh, you, you, you wear... Rubbish bags like pants, yeah, right? Like yeah. Then pants. you tape it up so they're sealed. Uh, then you go down to the local petrol station, get petrol. use the air compressor, yeah. shove it in, in there, inflate it. Right. It's people people that uh, get off on inflation stuff. That's yeah. actually a fetish. Yeah, I know request. someone that made money doing that. Like they would, <laughs> they they would like on OnlyFans or something. Well, that's an easy someone, just, someone just DM them on Instagram and was like, "I'll give you two hundred bucks if you send me a video of you inflating." Right. I think I have heard of. I think isn't there also the reverse where you wear like a bunch of like, like a latex. latex and then they like suckle the air out. Yeah, so you're like a fucking, you, you do uh, that with a garbage bag too. Yeah, the vacuum, like a preserved human. <laughs> yeah, dude, like <laughs> that. In the fridge. I I feel like I feel like all those like those the dad fetish is probably born like when you're at, when you're in a science class in school and they run that experiment in the classroom. Oh, yeah? and you could tell who has the fetish what? by looking at everyone's what? class. That was, that was an experiment? Hold on. No, <laughs> what kind of teaching did you have? Happened, yeah. this, happened, this happened in, the, in, my, in my high school. The experiment like, where they grab they, your cock. No. <laughs> no latex. It, like, so the idea is that they get this giant garbage bag, and then they have a vacuum, and, and they're trying to uh, show kids like w what the power of a vacuum is. Um, so, you know, we have like an atmosphere mm -hmm. of pressure on us or whatever. Yeah. So, like, when there's no air between you and that and you're just sucked in like you can't move against the vacuum right so like you know kids would you know volunteer or be chosen at random to be put in this garbage bag up to their neck and then they would you know insert the thing and then suck you in right. and then you would see like it, it literally pulled tight to their skin mm. and they can't move and that's when they start waterboarding them yeah. yeah and this is a high school <laughs> teacher doing yeah, this yeah literally like this oh, Oh, like this right here, it's, it's on screen. Audio listeners, you're gonna have to check out the video. Yeah, on literally, Spotify or it's YouTube. literally that. Holy shit! And then you can't move. You can't do anything. Yeah, that you're just hot. stuck. So that's, that's not. So yeah, that seems dangerous. dangerous. Yeah, don't yeah. show that one. <laughs> people, people find that erotic. Jeez. Yeah, so I, I feel like, like that's where the fetish is like. born for all those, yeah, all those be. kids. It's like, man, they, they must have had a really high science teacher that did that to them. Mm, Mrs. Mac. Sorry, what? what? Mrs. Mac with the good old shot. Mrs. What? Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, it's a weird fetish. Yeah, it, was an <laughs> yeah, it is an odd fetish. <laughs> odd request. Oh, I mean, $10 million is $10 million. So. Yeah. yeah, well, you know, it's back to you. Yeah, yeah so dude, I got... I Just got, making sure it's not weird or I anything. Got, I got fucking... I literally got scammed this week. What? Mm, yeah. You did. Yeah, I did. <laughs> did. Oh, so, yeah. yeah. I don't know I, if you could call that scamming, but well, carry on. Yeah, basically what happened is I'm getting new furniture for my house. Yeah. Because oh, I want to, like, fill it out. You're a dumbass. <laughs> yeah, I scammed that's... myself, I think. <laughs> um, so this is, a, this is a little tale for everybody listening on why you shouldn't order furniture when you're really high. Um, I got baked. I had two buying rips. I go upstairs. I'm like, I, I need to order some chairs. I need to order some new dining table chairs. And there are these chairs that look really good, but they're also really expensive. They're like $150 oh, a chair. Pricey chairs. And, so and, I'm like, pricey chair. and I'm like, these chairs look really cool, and like this furniture is going to last me forever, so I'll buy six of them. Mm. So I buy six of them. It's like nine hundred dollars that, that I spend on these chairs. Big chair investment. And, <laughs> and, it's, and it says like, oh, it'll 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 arrive. It'll arrive to my house in like fucking three days. Yeah. I wait the three days. I three days. I, <laughs> I, I open. <laughs> Say things that he says. I, I open. <laughs> I open my door. There's six fucking boxes, boxes outside of my house. I pull all of them in. They're all extremely oh, heavy. Can you fucking stop? <laughs> <laughs> They're all extremely heavy. I And I'm like, oh, these must be the chairs. Why are they so big? And why, why are they heavy. so heavy? And so heavy. I open it up. <laughs> I ordered six, six, um, six packs of four oh, chairs. Oh, you silly oh. duffer. You silly No, goose. not those. <laughs> you silly not those. But, the quality but, last yeah, it, it was right. a set of four. Uh, but wait, these so, are the chairs. So a set of four was 100, 130. 
Um, yeah, it so was now a you just have four. like six. I have twenty four twenty chairs. Twenty four chairs, and they're not even expensive house. chairs because so, they were actual packs of four. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> so, so, so I have twenty four <laughs> kind of cheap chairs. Right. So that now cost you me eight hundred dollars. Well, like invite people over and do like musical chairs. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Yeah. Or just buy a really big dining table. No. Oh yeah, get like the long skinny one. I, I called uh, I called the uh, the people up today. They just cracked up said, laughing. Yeah. Well, I said, hey, like here's. Here's the deal. And he's like, he's like, well, what's the problem? He says here, like, you ordered four packs of six. And, and, I was and they're like, like, what? You don't like sitting? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I said, like, no, I meant to order six chairs, not six packs of four chairs. And the guy was like, oh man, you fucked up. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I fucked up. Can I get a can I get a refund? He's like, well, let me see if you have purchase protection on. Yeah. Thank God, Thank I God got fucking did. purchase wow. protection because now I'm gonna You'll get five hundred dollars back. Purchase protection. Stay safe. Yeah, mm. yeah. yeah. Like four, four, four boxes I'm sending back. That's good. Right. Yeah. And you hung up. You like cheers? And he was like, "Yep, we sell those." Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, jeez. Oh yeah. man, you silly idiot. I am a you silly idiot. Fuck. You fucking dumb goof. cunt. Goose yeah. and a half. <laughs> but now, yeah, I'm not. I'm not smoking weed when I do important errands anymore. That's a lie. <laughs> yeah, until <laughs> eight couches rock up. Oh, did I almost? This way, I guess, furniture I, warehouse. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna start selling Persian rugs as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I almost ordered an extra rug today. It was it was fucking stupid. Oh so I'm a fucking idiot. Yeah. Okay. I'm a fucking idiot. He's off the weed. He's an absolute Anyways, mess. <laughs> I'm only on the gamer saps when it comes to when yeah. it when it comes to that shit now. Right. Speaking of gamer saps, gamer saps dad GG yep. Misfits Melon. New Misfits flavor Melon. is Absolutely out. Phenomenal. Is out. Fantastic, Fantastic. flavor. It's out, it's good, buy it. Gets you energized. Oh, look at it. Yeah. Oh. Use code Misfits. It's oh, me! It's, oh, us. Oh, it's oh. us! It's us! It's us! So sensational. Misfits famous. Melon. Damn, that bitch is hot. Oh. Now, another thing. Have we ever brought up, like, you know, what we intended to do for the ad uh, before the, you know, the the, oh, the, the, the Misfits and Melon Gamer Subs Misfits ad. Melon Gamer Subs ad. We had a plan. Because... What ended up coming out was we got a uh, a woman uh, by the name of Shiv Shiv Jam. Uh, she came in and you know did that whole thing that everyone saw on Twitter. Mm -hmm. But Titties. before that, we had this idea of like like my head would have like I would have drank the gamer subs. My head would have morphed into a watermelon, and then the melon would have exploded. Was that actually an idea? That was the idea. Okay, it was like just that we was gonna blow up melons in general. That was the original, and then right. Ryan just wanted to blow shit up. Right. And so everyone was like, "Yeah, sure." Yeah. But you know, well, th my thought process behind blowing them up was that you know we could just go to a fireworks store and get like a firecracker and just put it in and it'll mm. explode mm. but whoops we're in australia there, there's there's no fucking fireworks yeah. you can get that are like oh, that are like that shit, yeah so commie country ryan <laughs> organized uh liquid nitrogen that's uh, right he so I thought liquid nitrogen would be really, really fucking hard to get because it is so fucking dangerous to, yeah. to have in large quantities. Yeah. And he got like fucking 20 liters of it. Or you something can't like get ridiculous. <laughs> Dude, get liquid I know. Nitrogen. Like, and, I'm like, and, and he tells me, he's like, oh, hey, you know, come over. We have liquid nitrogen. I'm like, what do you mean you have liquid nitrogen? He goes, oh, we rented it. I was like, how? Rented it. How rent did you it. rent it? You can rent it. Yeah. So. Doesn't what, this kind of disappear though? No, what happens is. <laughs> He gives he gives like this task to Chris, yeah. and, and which is our one of our PAs, and he goes, "I want you to get, <laughs> I want you to get liquid nitrogen." He's like, "Okay." So he calls up his store, and he's like, yeah. "Hey, you know, do you have any liquid nitrogen? You know, we want we need it for like a video, a music video or whatever." Yeah. And the people are like, "Yeah, yeah, sure. How much do you need?" He goes, well, "You know, we can do two, we can do five, we can do 20. And he's like, "Oh, well, I don't know how much I need, so we'll just go like as much as we can." Yeah, and, mm -hmm. the, and they were like, "Yeah, okay." Uh, he goes, "Oh, well, do I just like pick it up?" And they go, "Oh, no, we'll drop it off. We'll just drop it off to Fucking you." And that. liquid nitrogen RS over here, just yeah, dropping it off. So the idea is that it comes in this giant, like you know, special container for liquid nitrogen, mm. um, and. You know, that's what you're renting, the, and the uh -huh. container in it. And so you have like a week or two weeks uh, okay. to use it all or use mm. as much as you need, and they take it back. Right. And it was it was a lot of <laughs> liquid nitrogen. It's awesome. Yeah. How, I mean, what's the worst that could happen um, with liquid nitrogen? You could freeze, freeze your arm off. You could, yeah, you could, right, yeah, you could give yourself frostbite. If you, if you have it in your car with all the windows rolled up, you could fucking kill yourself. You could you could you could Seems fucking suffocate and die. Oh, shit. Because it's, it's <laughs> <laughs> But no, it's, it was fucking around with liquid nitrogen was cool as fuck. Mm. And we yeah. uh, we we ended up 
experimenting with ideas of how to turn liquid nitrogen into an explosive. And the way, <laughs> it just sounds so bad. Yeah, it sounds yeah. so yeah. bad. Because that's, that's, that's the thing. You know, we're Googling like liquid <laughs> nitrogen bomb, how to make a bomb, how to, how to, how to make a nitrogen a, bomb, bomb, like a very <laughs> serious bomb. Mm. <laughs> Isn't that the one that wiped out Hiroshima? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Turn the old to ice. No, it, it was. <laughs> But yeah, th this um, <laughs> it was just, it was just sort of a bit cold for a day. Yeah. <laughs> so, oh, it's kind of chilly today. <laughs> God, that, that damn hydrogen that's yeah. liquid Nippy. nitrogen bomb. Oh what? yeah, it was a hydrogen bomb. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what we'd figured out was if you get a plastic water bottle. Wait, you, you you can't, you're not telling people how to make an yeah. explosive, are you? Hypothetically, if you were to, yeah. Have done so something hypothetically, like that. if we were, if we I mean, were, he also told them they can kill themselves by putting it in the <laughs> car. So. Yeah, I mean, look, it, hopefully it'll be a lot harder for other people to get it than it was for us because it was so fucking easy to get that amount of liquid. Yeah. Nitrogen. Can we get some royalty-free ukulele music on the background while the swagger explains how to make <laughs> a liquid really? nitrogen bomb. <laughs> that's a clip. <laughs> That's a, that's a YouTube I think, short. I have a feeling this bit's going to be cut out of the podcast. It will not be cut out of the podcast. It's the fucking Misfits podcast. We never cut anything. We don't cut a single I, thing. I think it's very illegal to, to talk about how to make a I don't bomb. think it's illegal. It's, no, it's, it's a tutorial. In it's game. Fair use. Yeah. Where's, where's, the, where's the copyright free ukulele? <laughs> Sorry, I was how to, make a, how to yeah. make a bomb in game. <laughs> okay, well, this, yeah. is, this is fine now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. hypothetically, yeah. How to make hypothetically, a bomb. if you were to make a bomb out of liquid nitrogen, you get a plastic water bottle, and then you you crush it down. Mm. Uh -huh. uh, you get a little, you know, little space enough for it to expand, wow. and then you <laughs> into it through a funnel, and then you cap it, and then you just toss it, and then <laughs> to a gas, why? and then why? Yeah. Because it is so cold that the ambient temperature is, you know, going to get it out of liquid state to gas. Mm. And because liquid is just gas really condensed, mm. you're going to have more gas, more of a volume than the liquid. And that's going to expand and put pressure on the inside of the uh, plastic bottle. And then... Like a gunshot. Oh. And hypothetically, yeah. we tested this twice at a park <laughs> uh, in, the, in the middle of the night. Um, hypothetically, lit off two fucking plastic water bottle liquid nitrogen bombs at like 30 minutes past midnight, and it was fucking, it, like, it was, you could hear it. Oh, there, there's, oh, there's oh, a clip. Oh, here's, here's, this here's, is a 3D here's, render. So these are plastic explosives. So, so this is a 3D rendered... In-game footage. Yeah. Footage. <laughs> Simulation, yeah. of, of what possibly transpired. Wow. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, damn. Damn. So it's, it's just a buildup of pressure. It's a giant buildup of pressure, right. and then it sounds like a gunshot. But it's it, it's not like really a, a fire explosion. No, if like you that. put... If, if you put, if, if you hypothetically put like... Oh. <laughs> Mm. Then, hypothetically, then hypothetically, you could probably make something yeah, that, that could be that, lethal. No, I think I think it was actually an ad in New Zealand about not throwing those at your babies <laughs> yeah. either. Yeah. Yeah. Gosh, like, mate, you just got a nice little pot of liquid nitrogen there, mate. <laughs> Try I not mean, to blow anything up. That, that's yeah. what makes grenades uh, dangerous, right? It's not actually the explosion; it's, it's the, the shrapnel. 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 It'd be the shrapnel. That's why they're like you look at the pineapple grenades; they're all like got like little notches on them. Yeah, yeah. dense. So if someone throws a grenade, you run as far as you can and then lie down because the shrapnel is going to go out. Or, Feet, feet pointed towards where the explosion yeah. would be. Right. Yeah. And yelled, Granada! Yeah. 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 And and yeah. To, to be cool, you know? Yeah. yeah. Another interesting thing about grenades, if one grenade was tossed towards you on land and then one was tossed into a pool, mm. would you lie down on land or would you jump into the pool? Jump in the pool. Jump no, the get pool. out of the pool. Wait. The pool. water's denser. It'll like, the shock yeah. wave would shock kill you. Shock wave fucking... I'd just still just jump fucking in the pool. kill you. Oh, Wait, you jump in the pool? No, don't jump in the pool. Okay, I'd still jump in the pool. I see you just got cold. a grenade tossed at <laughs> you. Yeah. Try not to jump in the pool with it, mate. Yeah. All right, don't go swimming with grenades. I okay. see. <laughs> well, the more you know. Damn, more speaking you know. of swimming, I went to the aquarium recently. Oh, yeah? Really? But, uh, Did you go was, swimming? It was a special... No, I didn't get to go swimming, I wish. But it was like a, a special experience. Uh... We got to go to the aquarium after hours once it was closed. Oh. So we, uh, me and my girlfriend were the only ones in there. Right. Walked around the aquarium by ourselves, explored it. Were and the then, fish like walking or some weird shit? Yeah, after some, hours? yeah the, the fish <laughs> were like cigarettes. They were sitting in the, in the cafeteria <laughs> having their dinner. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we, we got to go around the aquarium. And then uh, at the after you've had your little tour around, mm. the, you go down to the bottom floor where, the, uh, where you're under the water and the... 
wherever and uh there's like sharks and shit around you and you have a nice dinner mm. in like basically in the tank it's really cool wow oh, that's sick. Yeah. are you able to wow. sleep there as well i don't know because i oh, yeah, I saw, yeah. yeah I saw a video a stock of, photo of some people that's actually from the same one though oh. yeah well they look like they're having a good time yeah. this guy's sloshed <laughs> yeah <laughs> i saw a video of people sleeping there the whole night it seemed pretty cool yeah Wow. You can also uh, do, you, you can, drugs. Get, you can go there and <laughs> smoke crack. Mm. Oh. After yeah. hours. Yeah. After yeah. hours. Like, yeah. as in you just can or as in they serve it? <laughs> they they uh, serve it. It's on the menu, I believe. <laughs> Any yeah. crack tonight? No, and no. they go, no, the tanks are fine. Oh, oh. You mean crack. Oh, yeah. Mm. Of course. Yeah. Crack cocaine. Okay. Yeah. Got that. Excellent. Yeah, it was very cool. cool. Did you eat any fish? No. It was actually it? really weird the way they did it. It was like a set menu, but uh, instead of it being uh, like there was options. But instead of you being able to choose which one you want, they just brought out both. So one oh. person got the chicken and one person got the beef. It was weird. Point, he just pointed at the fish. I want that one. <laughs> and they just get a, every you day see, you just die die there. There. He just fucking <laughs> strangles it in front of you. <laughs> so he just grabs you by <laughs> the fin and you <laughs> smash <laughs> it against the glass. <laughs> He's right in front of you. His <laughs> <laughs> fucking eyeball pops out. <laughs> no, no, wrong one. Wrong one. Yeah, he's like, no, it's the wrong one. He's just like, oh, okay. Fuck. <laughs> I that, wish. That'd be lit if they did that. Yeah. Dude, I'd fucking go there every day. It was a cool experience, though. I think you would love it, Swagger. Yeah, dude. I used to <laughs> want to be a marine biologist. It's, imagine just like just transferring that setting to like a slaughterhouse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where like All the going. dead pig bodies no, are like or, hanging or, above or, you. Or, and or, or just like one. in a chicken farm. It was like you're <laughs> in the middle of a chicken farm <laughs> surrounded by just like a bunch of caged chickens. <laughs> walk, walk. Fear <laughs> in the air. And you're just like, they're having some nice, lovely fish. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 You, you point away, I want to have one. Guys are like, okay. Bang, he done. Chops his head off. He, he, he likes to run around. <laughs> oh, oh, it's a little trick. Oh, like he's running around. Oh, shit. Oh, all right. That's what you pay the big bucks for. That would yeah. be amazing. Yeah. That's a great idea. No one no one do that. I'll pattern that. Yeah. You'll pattern it? I'll pattern it. you make a pattern out of it? That's right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. A little motif. A little anyway. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you said you wanted to be a marine biologist when you Yeah, were dude. I was... No, he wants to be a Marine. No, have you guys... Oh, in the Marines. Because back when you were like 10 or 11, say even 12, did you have like a, a borderline obsession with, with one or two things? Like, I went from monkeys to being like obsessed with monkeys, which no. I still am. Still, still, still are. Yeah. Still a thing. Uh, to like going really hardcore, like hyper fixated into sharks. You know, por- sharks? <laughs> <laughs> So I had sessions too. Yeah, yeah, like so super into sharks. Yeah. Like I would read books and books and books. Like know everything about right. like almost all the fucking sharks. All right, hit me with a shark fact. Shark fact: Some sharks are oviparous. Some are oviviparous. What does that mean? What so that, that mean? means either they lay eggs or they do live birth, and in some instances they could do both. Some sharks well, he are from Paris. Sharks. Some sharks. Oh, I'm getting sharks this week. I got a fish tank yesterday. You're getting, you're getting sharks? sharks? Well, kind of like, like fake sharks. They Baby look sharks? like sharks. Oh, so you get, you're getting like the, 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 the gummy sharks? Is what kind of. They're like, it's a called? little black one. It's got like a little orange tail. Oh, he used to have one of those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sharks. Yeah. Uh, yeah, oh, no, I've always wanted those as a kid, but my fish tank wasn't too yeah, big. Yeah, they're super wild. You should have one. Wait, uh, you're getting a shark tank, like a big one? Yeah, no, I got it. That's right. Oh, yeah, by the way, that's I need help moving. Oh, you want me to lift up the shark? Yeah, it's like this big ass, like four foot, like fish tank. Holy shit. Let's do it. Damn, it was my day off it. yesterday, so I was just like, oh, what am I going to do today? I go on Facebook Marketplace. I was like, you know, I did always want to get a fish tank for this place. So I was like, okay, yeah. fuck it. I found like a fuck cheap it. van. For, That's like, a good idea. Just going on Facebook Marketplace and when you're bored and just finding yeah. something. <laughs> just yeah. Get a shark tank. Afternoon. And then you just always got like a little box where people are just pitching ideas. And <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just <laughs> waiting for that. It's a few billionaires. Great. I just, shut up, Shark Tank. <laughs> <laughs> Not today. <laughs> it's, it's a shit product. You I'll know. take it's five like percent of your company. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's sick. I've, yeah. Uh, yeah. That, that, like, I've always wanted a uh, aquarium in my home. Yeah. 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 See, Unfortunately, can, I'm just a few million off. But. Yeah. <laughs> you can get fish tanks, but you want a big one because yeah. you want to have cool fish. Mm-hmm. I don't want to have fucking goldfish. Exactly. Cringe. Yeah. You want to have yeah, room. Fuck that. You yeah. want to have some nice real estate in there. Mm. I yeah. want a fucking manta ray. Yeah. I want a whole <laughs> ecosystem. In Australia? I don't know about that. Man. I want an that eagle ray. Oh, okay. An eagle ray? Yeah. There was one of those in the aquarium. It flaps like a bird a under bird. the water. It's fucking cool. That's sick. <laughs> That's actually fucking like disgustingly mm. sick. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Putrid. Have you just got... <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Have you seen those cool aquariums that are like terrarium kind of things where mm. it's all underwater and like they have plants that make the oxygen and they have so, like yeah. snails and 
I do like bonnet feeders and like aquatic oh, bugs. Yeah, like yeah. like yeah. yeah. clean the glass. Yeah, yeah. Clean the the glass and other bottom and feeders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and like yeah. if you if you um just speed up time, yeah. then eventually little people yeah. will come out of the water. Yeah, and start a bowl, yeah. yeah. I want a bonsai tree. <laughs> it's kind yeah, of, that's fair. Yeah, they're but, expensive. Really? Yeah. No, oh, I right. got one the other day at like, was it Bonnings? Yeah, what they sell them. Okay, okay, but yeah, if everything. you want a good one, they're expensive. Oh yeah, yeah. like <laughs> getting those like, small bonsai. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, it wasn't shit like that. It was Wait, like some like weed bonsai. Is crazy. They yeah. just they <laughs> met they. Was there marijuana bonsai? Please, that's sick. Please. Please, but, yeah. dude, I can't fucking grow one here. It's illegal. But for it to be bonsai, so you smoke weed here and it's illegal. Yeah, it's but growing that. and smoking are two different things. It but, looks like little people would live there. I think there are some states in Australia where you can grow weed. Dude, that is sick. Well, but bonsai have to be literal trees, right? Like, yeah, that's they, what they are. I mean, yeah. they're, like they're plant, not a plant. Tr- they aren't plants. Just well, they tree. are in the sense that trees are plants, but they're like literally the same genetic structure. They're the trees tree, that they like right? get wrapped they have in an actual trunk. They get like wrapped in wire. Yeah, and then like they just have to be constantly trimmed and like made small. Right. Shit. Basically, uh, they're just squeezed down. <laughs> they're just mini trees. <laughs> Quite painful. You're actually torturing the plant for your yeah. just yeah. enjoyment to look at. Right. Yeah, it's like when people put uh, a cage around an apple that's growing so that it makes a square apple. Yeah, <laughs> or like a Buddha. Square the Buddha pears. Have you seen the Buddha pears? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Fuck, man. This shit's crazy. Some fruit cruelty right there. Yeah, it's like an ice cube mold, but for a growing, living thing. Mm. You should do that to newborn babies. <laughs> Isn't that how midgets I are made? formed? That's Just how Minecraft new babies. Steve was made. Try not to make them a square head. <laughs> that's how babies get abs. <laughs> what? They just put a thing on them that has abs on it so that they grow just out into their abs. Indent. Yeah. I'd, lo- I'd love to just put in like a, a cube behind my newborn's head and name him Steve. Steve. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> it was some Minecraft Steve shit. Yeah, just watch him get bullied. Dude, dude. <laughs> you know how he got to get bullied? Someone with a square head. He just fucking go. He's a lead. He, just sw- yeah. he just fucking Super Mario 64 like thwomp you. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, dude. I I probably bully that kid. Yo, dude. <laughs> yeah. What What if you gave him like a like, like a like a triangle out front? You named him Phineas. Phineas. Oh. oh. Yeah. And that's from the show Phineas, Phineas and, and Ferb, which is a great show. It's a great, great show. show. Great show. Phineas and Ferb. Doofenshmirtz. Doofenshmirtz. Evil Incorporated. Yeah. Lovable guy. Yeah. Much like Hitler. When we yeah. think about it, just to refer back to our earlier conversation, <laughs> Doofenshmirtz is also a misunderstood villain. Uh, yeah. yeah, okay. German, smart, <laughs> smart. Sexy. Wait, he's German? Yeah. Yeah, Doofenshmirtz. Yeah. Doofenshmirtz. Smart, sexy, Loves German. Loves making inventions. Like, makes kill inventions. the Jewsinator. Kill all the Jewsinator. But Perry the Plat- was, that's, that's the problem. With the 1940s, there's no Perry the Platypus to prevent it from happening. Yeah. yeah. There's no one to swoop in with his charisma and semi-aquatic attitude. Yeah. Why didn't Perry the, the Platypus stop COVID-19? <clears throat> yeah, that's true, actually. It started in the tri-state area. Yeah. <laughs> COVID-19 started in the tri-state, <laughs> the tri-state area. area. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, somewhere out there, there's a Phineas and Ferb episode. It's waiting to happen. I wonder. You got COVID, Ferb? I wonder what sort of shows uh, kids are watching now. It's this show called uh, Swipe Infinitely on a fucking bullshit app. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I do that. <laughs> oh, disgusting. I don't, know. I don't know. I actually don't know. I haven't sussed out. I they, s- do people even watch TV anymore? Like, kids I guess don't they watch TV. They really. I guess they watch YouTube. You know, now. well, I was yeah. watching Cartoon Network. Yeah, Cartoon and Network. On, while I was on a holiday, and there was a Ben Ten episode that popped up, and you guys remember Ben Ten, yeah. right? Like it was fucking sick. Yeah, great the show. animation on that shit now is so yeah. bad. I think it was always a bit bad. No, no, no. This is like it was made by like six year olds. It was like, so it's like, bad. It's like fucking Teen Titans. You remember how bad yeah, ass the original way more Teen Titans was? It, it was like so an anime, and now it's just yeah. You know, I mean, it's for kids. Right. I mean, you even look crazy. at old SpongeBob, and you're like, "Wow, this is yeah. like meaningful. Like these these episodes are good. They're well written." You look at yeah. new SpongeBob, it's just Insane. like it's like I fucking took three tabs of acid and watched like new age SpongeBob. Like, is you have the worst trip of your life? Mm. Yeah, cartoons are lame now. I mean, maybe we just got older. <laughs> yeah, it could be that. It could be the fact that we just got older and more mature, and we have positive memories associated with what we used to watch as children because yeah. they gave us positive. Information. I yeah. guess, Maybe but the also, kids will grow up and be like, man. I don't think so there's, good. but I still don't think there's like undenying the fact that with with a lot of shows that have just been on forever, like the quality as it goes on is is shit. Mm. Like like The Simpsons. Yeah, yeah. Dude. Well, eventually just run out of ideas. There was a Simpsons episode where Homer finds a dead body. 
when he was a kid. Oh, in the Japanese Suicide Forest? Oh, no, that's Logan Paul. <laughs> oh. No, yeah, I'm talking Homer Simpson. Okay. That the oh. episode gave me, like, nightmares. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I watched it the other day and I was, was like, it, can't sleep still. Was it a Tree House of Horror episode? No, it was just a normal episode. It was oh, just startling really, you like that out of yeah, the Yeah, was, I was like, I think I was like eight or something. Mm. And then he finds a dead body and he can't stop screaming I, I because of the one. trauma as a kid. Oh, my God. It was fucked. It was so fucked. Yeah. Wow. Dude, like, yeah. I saw this shit on Twitter of... Uh, it was like Homer Simpson, like as a as a teenager, and apparently, like it's now with the new season, it it says that he was a teenager in the nineties. Yeah, but that would make him canonically like younger than Bart. Wow, which is kind of crazy when you think about it, right? I can't wrap my head around because that. it's been because the show's been around concept. since the nineties. Oh, so true, like, true, they true. had flashbacks yeah. before. It was like he was a fucking yeah. teen in the in like the, the fucking fifties or sixties or yeah. whatever. So, and, yeah. and now he's like a teen in the nineties to make Shit. it more relatable to da- to, the, to today's kids. Oh, I wish they didn't do that. Yeah, I really wish they didn't do that. It's fucked up, dude. Yeah. It makes me so fucking angry. <laughs> it's really yeah. fucked up. <laughs> I agree with that. Pen. Fuck that. <laughs> it's got something cold in my throat there. <laughs> <laughs> Who put socks on the teddy? Why is there yeah. all of a sudden socks on the teddy? Why is there he's also handcuffed. Mm. Yeah, but he's been handcuffed for a few weeks. Kinky bitch. I don't know. Socks. Why not? Why can't the teddy wear socks? What do the socks say? They've got Yo, can you pass me those handcuffs? <laughs> do they stink? No, okay, we're good. We're good. Those are tiny ass handcuffs. They're definitely made. They are Jesus. small handcuffs. This is a flashback to Must the be Poland for kids. story. <laughs> <laughs> the, the story that began it all for the misfits, the Poland story. Mm-hmm. What an absolute crazy ride. I wasn't there, but you know, I'm sure Helen enjoyed listening <laughs> yeah. to that shit. It same, sounds crazy. And funnily uh, enough, I was at Auschwitz when that happened. So you you were, actually were. Yeah, I was at Auschwitz. Yeah. I was visiting shit. Hitler. Yeah. Is someone watching this that's new is going to think this is just like a bit? Like yeah, but no, I was. Like, no, you were genuinely happened. there. I was at Auschwitz. It was very yeah. cold. It was snowing. Yeah. Um, yeah. They didn't. They didn't have a cafeteria or anything. <laughs> <laughs> With all those ovens, it was so just weird. Well, yeah, they're yeah. gonna be authentic to the real experience, though. Dude. No gift shop. Why well, you just sound like a Jew talking about their experience at Auschwitz? <laughs> there was no cafeteria. I went to Auschwitz recently. No, no cafeteria. <laughs> no gift no shop. Gift shop. <laughs> In fact, I feel I feel rather mistreated. <laughs> the service was <laughs> lost. My family. That was awful. <laughs> Fucking they're gone. Yeah. No bathrooms. No bathrooms. Shit, dude. Firing squads. Yeah, what am I supposed to do? Their walk. <laughs> God, I lost 100 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> I look, I'm in the best shape of my life. <laughs> oh, it's no. like a base bar. Oh. It's uh, a very uh, Holocaust-y episode. <laughs> very Holocaust-y. I Holocaust-y. Uh, Jesus impact Christ. Bottom line. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, I'll think I have fun listening back to this one be like, nope, can't have that. What, nope, what is this? Oh. Mitchell. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Wow, this, this episode is just all over the place. Can't you cop trademark that? What, what is this you're showing us? Making yeah, a Swagger Souls helmet? Is, if you look up Swagger Souls on Amazon now, people are like putting my name over like oh, over, actual, over like oh. Chinese knockoff versions of my helmet. Oh. Damn, that's sick. That's so, crazy. So like for when Halloween rolls around, they probably make a bunch of money. Yeah, look, look there's there's like a, a fucking jacket yeah. that looks exactly oh, like oh, mine. Oh, it's like the whole costume. That's yeah, so right. sick. People, people uh. dress up as me for fucking oh, Halloween look, they, now. That's how you really look right there. Oh, <laughs> shit. No, <laughs> that's the swagger soul's face mask. It's <laughs> incredible. That's crazy. Oh, that's yeah. actually that's shoes. insane. Yo. Swagger soul's condoms. <laughs> Damn, that's sick. So I guess so I guess it's like a pre-workout. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a first aid, aid for men. First aid for men. Stay <laughs> true to the character. You, smash, you pop a couple of fruit aids for men and smash the <laughs> yeet button. Have some great oh sex. Oh my god, there's no way. I can't believe you just fucking pulled this out. How is this not Yo, scripted. it's a pickle speak blue pickle button right to do a Bluetooth it's speaker ring. <laughs> <laughs> 40. I don't know. Weird. All right. That's insane. Okay. Oh, this has been the Amazon. Is that a section. cock ring? What was that? It does, man. I mean, God it, only knows. Cock rings are weird. <clears throat> mm. Yeah, they, they go on your you cock and cock stuff. Like, what? Have you ever used a cock ring? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I have. <laughs> yeah. They're, yeah. They're, they're not. Is amazing. that the ones with like the vibrator on it, or just like an actual ring ring? <laughs> oh, no, it's, <laughs> a, you, you, it's a, the vibrator. It's. Oh well, there's like multiple kinds. I've just used like the regular like regular oh, one, like, just out of curiosity. Regular. Oh. Weird. Do, do, you, do you like put your nuts like no. through the through the hole no, as well? I, I'm not. I don't. I'm not into it. I just was like, oh, this is. That's not I'll try that. I didn't enjoy it. <laughs> but like, isn't isn't the whole reason for the cock ring is to keep you erect for yeah. longer? Yeah, but oh. that'll that'll happen if you just put it around the base of the shaft. I got one. Uh, 
th- that vibrates so that it would ha- like yeah. for her pleasure. Mm. Mm. Well, how generous of you. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't very good. <laughs> I've though. seen those ones though. Yeah. yeah no, they they sell them at supermarkets here. I can't imagine it would be very good. They had one of those in the fucking little baggie. Yeah, yeah. In yeah back in back yeah. in Europe in Rotterdam. That little feather in there. I think a blindfold yeah. too. It's more of an uh, old folks thing, I think. The old cock rings. I don't know. Maybe mm. I just didn't use it. Ye around. old yeah. cock ring. Ye old <laughs> cock ring. Because <laughs> they don't they don't make you last longer, and they don't really. I guess maybe they make you a little bigger. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, interesting. Because <laughs> of the, the blood. Anyway. Oh, wait. I thought you were supposed to wear it. It's like a gemstone. It like helps you keep it erect or what, something. What, around your... Uh, what? Yeah, well, it's, just wear like it's an actual a, It's ring. an aura. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. I have little crystals the, on my the, the energy. <laughs> Chakras. <laughs> it's just a ring with like an iced out dick. Yes. <laughs> People get those little cock cages. Oh, They're like chastity oh, belts, yeah. but they go oh, over your dick. Yeah. Those, those, some those, medieval shit. I don't understand. Those make me cringe every yeah. time. It looks yeah. awful. It's like terrible. if you get in the erection, the choice is pushing up. It hurts. The, yeah, I it like very oh, yeah. I didn't think but of that. It's for like the celibacy fetish thing. Yeah, yeah. I, I yeah. like my cock free range. Or it's like, like or <laughs> uncaged cock. Yeah. That's some hardcore like no fap shit right Free range. I guess it's like corn fed. Corn fed cock. I guess it's like... I'm only allowed to have erections if they're from my wife or something, you know. And, and your wife has the keys; she yeah. unlocks it when you get home. What when is you're it? Out. Like a cage, cage, like yeah, a box just, cage. Just literally, <laughs> like how do you put cage. pants on? Mitchell, Mitchell, pull, Mitchell, pull yeah, up Mitchell, a picture pull. of a cock cage without oh. a penis in it, please. Yeah, no <laughs> penis, no penis in the cock cage. Wait, that's or at least crazy. A dummy penis. Yeah, that's crazy. I like that though. I like that. I mean, I don't like that, but I like what you said about it being. <laughs> yeah, free look at this. Oh, oh. shit! Oh, it's glass. They're all kinds. No, it's like they they plastic. Plastic. metal. That looks terrible. Oh, yeah, it's don't, metal. Yeah, what's gonna happen if you get, <laughs> get off the screen? Those what? plastic clear ones look like they. I'm gonna be honest. If I saw that in a shop, I would think that was like something for, like for, for a, a baby. For a baby. It looks. It, it's like you know, light blue. It's plastic. It looks. Oh, you think it's like a pacifier? It looks like a pacifier. Hmm. Well, yeah. The more you know, huh? Mm. Cock cages. Cock cages. Caucasians. That's what we are. Caucasians yeah. with the cock cages. <laughs> it's a bar. <laughs> no, it is not. <laughs> Guys, uh, it's been an hour, you know. Okay. It has. We're we, sort uh, of just vibing right now, we're, aren't we? We're literally cruising through so many different topics. It's been great. Quite topical. Sorry about all the Hitler talk. So, you know, I'm not. It was I, funny. I, I think that was much better than the cock cage <laughs> and cock yeah. green discussion at the end there. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Hitler had one. Maybe that's why mm. he was so mad. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, but, I guess. Mm, maybe not. Godzilla or Kong? Who's, Who's winning? winning? Bro, it's a radioactive God, dinosaur. It, Come on. I don't know, dude. Big monkey. Yeah, but Kong, they become Kong used tool. I'll tell you who's winning the box office. You know? yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. What if like the, the it, it gets to a point where they fight and then like it's an equal match and then an even bigger enemy shit. shows oh, up and they shit. have to join forces to fight them. I want to see would... Cthulhu show up. Cthulhu's badass. He true. Fuck, <laughs> fuck King Kong. Cthulhu. Fuck Godzilla. Cthulhu, man. Cthulhu. Cthulhu probably could fuck King Kong and Godzilla at the Cthulhu's same time. Sick. Cthulhu sick. Threesome. I love like underwater <laughs> Leviathan shit. Wait, so who's dope. Cthulhu? Cthulhu's the the un, the deep the the deep ocean slumberer, the yeah. uh, creature of the sea, the god of the sea. He's the kraken head. And uh, is there like a photo of this we can pull? I I've can never pull heard of Cthulhu. You've never heard of Cthulhu? No. How have you never heard of Cthulhu? Come on. Like maybe one of the most popular Very famous. of all time. He's got so many mm. followers. HP <laughs> Lovecraft. He's, He's a go. great actor. HP Lovecraft. Yeah, what the fuck? So just imagine like this motherfucker coming out of the ocean someday. There is some really cool, like, look at this. Oh my God. He's so sick. Uh, He's Kong so versus sick. Cthulhu. Just destroys ships. Godzilla. I, I like to imagine that somewhere deep in the very depths of the ocean where no one has explored, he he's, he lies, he slumbers, and one day he will awaken, and you'll just see him just rise from the shoreline mm. and walk towards society. And, and then as soon as up. he approaches the shores, he starts doing an epic TikTok dance because he wants <laughs> to get to, he, he, he's, he's going to dominate TikTok. That's, yeah. that's yeah. what he's into doing. That's, that's, what, that's his purpose. Yeah. He's just been waiting for TikTok to come. Mm-hmm. Someone's going to make that now. Yeah. I hope so. I hope someone. I hope there's someone listening to this podcast at home that's a really good 3D animator, and they're just like, "I'm going to animate Cthulhu coming out of the ocean and doing a TikTok dance." If I, you make that, tweet it at us. I doubt they will. At Misfits, at <laughs> tweet it. I just hope there's someone listening to this podcast. <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> yeah, by the end. Yeah, yeah. It's the end, guys. It's over. Another yeah. week on the show. We hope you enjoyed. We do. Genuinely. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> Yeah. Otherwise, what's the point? Yeah, what is the point? Did Thank you enjoy you it? Did yeah. you enjoy it? What a waste. I hope so. Leave us a comment on YouTube if you did. Anything else to add, guys? No. Then fuck you.
Lighter. Oh. Uh, bye. Bye. <laughs> See ya. Lighter. <laughs> I'm trying to end the story. It's been awkward. Later. Lighter. 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 <laughs>